How to spot fake Dior Soreal sunglass for women's. As you can see, this is a replica version, and to be honest, this is one of the, in a way, I would say it's a very poor quality version, and there's no point buying one. Okay. Um, first of all, is um, I would like to start. I was would be how it came. Um, how it was how it was packaged. Okay. Um, it came in a package. I was literally had Chinese writing on it, and obviously this is a made in Italy um, sunglass. All right, as it clearly says it on one of the sides. Um, here, as you can see, it says made in Italy. All right, um, and honestly, as you can see, this is a Christian Dior sunglass. All right, um, it came in a Chinese writing. Obviously, you're gonna think, all right, look. It's a made in Italy sunglass. Why would it come from China? So obviously th that's one way to actually, you know, spot on that, that this is a fake. All right. On top of that, it's how it was packaged. Literally, it was one of the poor packaging and the way it came. Was, you know, I'm on, it's obviously at the end of the day, this is gonna be returned because I just wanted, I just wanted to see the difference. All right. Um, it, this came. All right. It was literally front of the sunglass like this to protect it. And how I was thinking, how would this protect this sunglass? All right. On top of this, you had this package, literally just a see-through package, which yeah, the whole sunglass was in it. Um, you had you had this to protect one side of the sunglass. I think it's because when you fold it, obviously it probably touches your. Well, why don't you just put it on both of them? Um, what what f frustrated me mostly was these two. All right, it came in a cloth. All right, just a plain random coloured cloth. All right, with no you know branded sunglass will have at least the brand name on the cloth at least all right it's not even that look when i stretch this here all right now as you can see it's it's very poor quality as well look it just makes that um that crease in the middle as you can see um well this is just one weird color literally look this is a black um sunglass um, sunglass black design sunglass with silver outlines all right they should at least give a black cloth all right, just to match it, and more. The more funny thing is that, all right, there's no box. All right, literally, you know, this is where you know it's fake because, you know, any sunglasses, a huge, a big company sunglasses like this, has to come with a box with manual. No, not even manual. Okay, fine, but leave that. But at least a box, okay, with a genuine case. Literally, what kind of case is this? Like, come on, flattery. Just they probably made it up and just gave it to me. All right. Uh, when I saw this, I literally, obviously, you know, it's it probably the worst um, how to spot um, video I'm actually making out of all the other ones I actually made. Let's seriously. Um, on top of that, as you can see, the glasses itself is quite um, quite good. All right. When you know, most of the times, um, when you hold it up high and to see the difference, um, the original one would be more heavier. All right. This one, okay, it doesn't really, sh you know, rattle as much, alright? It's probably them two, if you just actually stop that, it won't really rattle much. And it got that quality, it got that, say, a tiny bit of that okay quality, um, quality that you need, alright? On top of that, it has that nice feel, of, um, feel when you wear it, alright? But obviously you won't get that luxurious one because this is a replica, alright? Um, on top of that... Also, they gave you uh, they gave you a small portable screw if you need to adjust it. All right, and on top of that, it has the writing on it, as you can see. It's a Christian Dior here. And it says so real. Boy, MD, I literally don't know what the hell that is, but yep, yeah, so real. And it says made in Italy at the uh, it's right at the end of the thing. Now on this side, obviously, he just said Christian Dior. Um. Also, obviously, I think it's engraved here. Hopefully, my camera captures it. I think you can see it, but yeah, it just says CD, which stands for Christian Dior. Um, both side. Um, uh, overall, I would just say, obviously, other than the packaging and the way it was packaged, the box didn't come. It came in a random um, case, uh, random, you know, literally, it doesn't even match the actual, actual sunglass. No name on it. And other than that, it, the sunglass was all it was all it was all, all right. The um, quality of it, that's it. It wasn't perfect, but it was okay. But hopefully, you know, this you saw the difference while I went through, and how it came. 
so please like and subscribe and i hope this video actually helped you out